Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Vega Conflict. I wanna um, show you guys some of my base fights and how I think they could improve. So let's get to it. All right, guys. Before we get to it, I just want to show this is a plate test server. Uh, these bases, they're 100 times stronger than a regular base. So yeah, as you can see, he's level 8, 118, um, 123. So let's get to it. Shields. Our shields are gone. At first, I just like the phase of real quick because I like punching the face. Before I go on the battle, I had it now. But for this setup, as you can see, he does have new weapons. Um, these were added to the live server, but not to pieces yet. But. Yeah. show you guys my base setup for a second it's not fully done but after the live server hits it will be a level 100 this is on the um, Plato server so yeah now this is probably the most powerful little base there is I know you could probably get this around level 95 or 80 85 I think so but you could but let me tell you Module. these modules are like tanks they do 312,000 health um, calibers, full shield bypass, and some shields. I don't really care about them. But yeah, that's all four modules, right? And then we have the health module. I mean, um, storage modules. They too have 306,000 health. And they're very effective. I would like to make my base for this time. I like to have a ring of um, combat modules on the outside, the middle storage, and the inner is all my important stuff. My crafting, it's, it's not really that important. It dies real fast, so it repairs too fast. Real fast, yeah. But these mines, they do 16,000 damage. So all drones passing through the mines will die so it's very effective now my base my base does has almost 500,000 health now that's a little bit OP for level 100 so a level 105 the max that can attack this and that won't even kill it like it will die this base is so OP let me tell you I survived 
arc attacks. And just a heads up, arcs, they're not even effective. They just mounts off everything. And like, they only take about 5% on your whole base. 5%, that's, a, that's, that's hardly any damage. Now, now we have an issue where the bases have more health than the ships and do more damage. So now the scale is kind of um, overbalanced on the base on the base side. It's not balanced no more. The bases have way more health. The attacking player can't really def can't really cause any damage. I mean. It's gonna spend the whole time getting through my protective circle. It's never gonna, it's never gonna hit the base. It's never gonna hit the bridge. It's gonna have to go through each one of these. Each one of these have three hundred thousand health. Three hundred thousand. This one does ten thousand. Somehow this thing does 10,000 DPS. The weapon shows it only does 8,200. That don't make sense. But yeah, I'm not even done upgrading this stuff. I don't even need to upgrade it. My fleet bay is so protected. Like I can just leave my. F if if you have like a level 80, you could have no guns to so just have a bridge of fleet bay and a craft bay, and a um. Fleet Bay and a ship like factory. Dead. That's all you need. That's all you really need. You can just have a couple of drones. You're level 80. Nothing will be able to beat you. 85. Nothing will be able to beat you. I mean, Stasis was the only thing that was stopping these low bases. Because Stasis would basically, like, destroy a ship from getting inside. Like, I would use my, um, Imperial Burst to, like, one shot at base. I can't do that anymore. Imperial Burst does nothing. It does nothing. It's only two OP. Yeah, this and look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh they flip and resist 75%. 75%. That's crazy. Like, I could have the chance to put these. They're not really loading right now, for some reason. They kind of glitched. But I could put these on. Oh, 11,000 range. Dang, that's crazy. I may put that on the bridge. I'll put one on the bridge to test it out. And the other thing about the needle dry turrets, listen, they, they don't pierce. They only pierce like five mm -hmm. ships. So basically, if you have a base full of needle drives, so they only pierce three. If you have, if you have a base full of needle drives, right, you could use a. What can I say? Border side. You can literally sit in one edge and just spam all your drones. And the base won't even oh my God. land a shouting. Because they only pierce five percent, as you see with the calibers. Uh, with the Ca calibers pierce three. They only pierce three, but I've seen calibers going through going multiple, down. multiple clusters of drones from the border sides, and like it's still down. hitting the ship. So three on this thing is a lie. That's cop. That's a that's a lie. But yeah, these new health items should have a significant more XP boost. See, the problem is, listen, look, look, look. If I have a bear module, right? This one right here. If I have a bear module, right? Listen, look. Look at this. This is outrageous. Look at myself I have. XP at. I have this much, right? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. This much. Okay, you got it, yeah. Venus, like, use this module. 632 million. Right? So, so I get the module, right? Module. I get it. Now, just watch this, watch this, watch this. I'm put an automatic drive on this. I went up a little bit, right? Automatic drive. Listen, 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 look. Then I'm gonna put on the caliber. Level three. Level two. I just put on a caliber. And it only gave me about uh, like um twelve million RP, bro. XP, XP, twelve million RP, XP. Like that's crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. And you can do this on crazy things. Listen. If you put all caliber level threes on your base go, go, and then go, when live server comes, you put on new guns, they will literally give you very little XP. Very little. Very little. Hey, listen. Look at this. That's not done. Let's go! Does that make any sense? Oh, I got 20. That don't make no sense, bro. Oh, listen, listen. Okay. I'll put this on, right? I ain't even going up no XP. I only only went up 3 million XP, bro. I added 2 health on here. Almost 200,000 damage. I mean, not damage. Health. Dang it. Talking about. That's all you need. Uh, uh, Look at that. Nothing. Three million RP. This base has like flipping three hundred thousand hip. This is a classic three buckler build. Not hard, very simple. Very Alright, I'll find a tech my this man right here. Base level one or six. I got 109. Of course, I could have like put like another ship in there, but I don't want to risk it. But let's... now his base. Look at his base. His base is stacked the heck up. This is a monster size base.
I can't survive that. But let me go ahead and defend this hill. This should be like a level threshold where you can only put something on your base if it's like a certain level or not even like a certain level. Like, yeah, a certain level. Because it, I can effectively base like a low level with the regular. Health. There's no need for like a regular base to have. One module to have 312,000 health. There's no need. It's outrageous. Y'all finally start making me mad. This dude won't get the heck out of my base. Yeah, so that's basically all I had to say. Like, they could fix some of the stuff. Like, Modules I have the max I have modules I have is two hundred thousand. That's a decent. Or not even like yeah, two hundred thousand decent. And even if you did have all this all this health, why the heck is this thing has seventy five percent resist? What the heck is y'all doing? Like I could be fine, I could kill a base if it didn't have seventy five percent resist. Resistance.